and it has all these different influences. We have um, this kind of jazz influence. There are some very famous Ethiopian jazz exponents in the world. I kind of knew that. But also, they have a very long and deep um, Coptic Eastern church tradition, which um, you will hear throughout this concert as well at a certain stage. And also, there are modes, certain scales, that are particular to the Ethiopian culture uh, and East, East African culture. And they have names like Ambasel and Bati and Tizeta, I think. And so this gives this wonderful richness to the music. And Ambasel being one of those modes, which I will now demonstrate. Okay, so if we can have trumpet from, from A for three bars. So that's when you have the line by itself. And when you put two of those lines together, it sounds like this. One, two, done. So it's quite a, an exotic sound to my ears, and one that I really enjoy. I'm 
Well, we're going to go from that song called That Guy Is Mine to something very different and a very sacred and old piece and quite um, special for this evening in that um, it has never been written uh, for a Western orchestra before. It is a, a traditional song called Zela Senya and it's written by a man named Yared from the 6th century from the Ethiopian church tradition and I think they named the another mode and this song is sung in that mode called Yared and um, maybe Sibley could give us a little clue as to what this song is about. He called me but um, I was just quiet. He, you called me I was just quiet. It's not because I didn't want to talk to you because I haven't heard you. I haven't, I didn't hear you. Didn't hear your voice. Didn't hear your voice, yeah. So, Zela Sebleginva. And the Tasmanian Symphony Orchestra. <laughs> 